What's up guys and welcome back to Murdered Soul Suspect. In the last video we entered the apartment and here we are. Our objective right now is to get to the 4th floor apartment. But as you can no doubt tell there are other things to do here including talk to that guy. You know there's the, sure this couple that we can talk to. Talk to, see? And also there are things we can look at like these. These are uh, info about the killer, the bell killer. Uh, things like uh, newspaper articles, uh, posters, uh, newspaper clippings, all that sort of thing. There is a side quest here. Let's talk to this lady. You look lost. What's lost is my body. I know I got killed right here. So yeah. And I know it sounds crazy, but but I feel a lot better if if I knew where my huh? body was. What? <laughs> Are you a detective or something? Over overlaid subtitles. You might be my only help. Yeah, I'm a detective. Any idea who did it? Uh, yeah, freaking other subtitles interrupting my conversation. I know they were old people. And I know they lived in this apartment building. Not even that. Everything is hazy. It sounds like that old couple that we just saw with the old lady in the hair colors and the bald old man sitting on the couch. I'll see what I can find out from any older residents of the building. And this opens up our side quest. A the first side quest. Oh, also figments. These things. See, boom. We can collect them, and it unlocks this. I need seven of them to unlock the full story. Here's another one. As far as I can tell, I think there's only two boilers on the bottom, on the first floor, right here. Uh, I can't remember because it's been a while since I've played this. Ta-da! But did you know about the murder of the girl in the laundry room? So I can possess them and influence them, but I don't have enough clues that, that yes, I must dispossess them. <laughs> Her. Reveal this figment and inspect it. And oh goodness gracious, it's a break at the quarry. A lot of these things are actually red herrings if you think, if, uh, if you think about it. Or if you've played through this thing once like I have. Look at this note. And there's another figment here. Yep. Gardening tools. And then I... Will we get the full one of this instead of a... He's like, oh, but cool, a darker memory. Uh, the newspaper clipping, the note from the neighbor, made the gardening tools. Now we get to select her. <laughs> Which is so strange. I never did this. It's kind of obvious the clues that clues so you're supposed to give with this, but <laughs> whatever. I think she was on drugs. Walter was so tired he couldn't bear to stay awake for the five miles it took her to drive to sleep with Quarry. I couldn't believe he was able to find a pair of lock covers that late at night. At least the music has stopped. Now we can finally sleep. <gasps> oh my goodness, it looks like the old woman has a secret, and wouldn't you know it? The old man, that's a secret too. That girl collapsed like paper when Grace hit her. I still can't believe she died. It happened so fast. I've never seen Grace so crazy before. It must have been the lack of sleep. Thank God it's all over. I can finally watch TV in peace. <laughs> Without the old lady bothering you? Dispossessed. What happens to the murder girl's body? Find an answer. And now we must put these events in order. See the three question marks at the top of the screen? We need to put these events in order. So what happens is the uh, uh I think it was the old I think it was the mysterious murder first, and then the old woman's secret, and then the old man's secret. And that's it. Huh. Ta-da! Looks like Grace couldn't take the girl's party anymore. So she killed her and broke her husband and dumped the body and smacked the get back And that's it. That's essentially how the side cases work as far as I know. Reason can't I'll probably encounter more horror versions of this in the future because I've only played one hour of this and I have not gotten far in the game. I've only managed to get up to the fourth floor which is where you're supposed to go and then I stopped my session for that, that day and then I found that all my audio was missing and I got so fed up I stopped. I thought they were just being unreasonable. I didn't know they would do this. <sighs> Thanks for your help. You have no idea how big a relief it is just knowing. And ta-da! You know, oh. I never really liked cops. Never mind. She's still talking. I shall take another bite of apple. I never 
saw eye to eye on things. But you really came through for me. Probably should have listened to what they were trying to tell me. Maybe then things wouldn't have ended up like this. Thanks again. And just like that, Tada, I've helped her move on. Okay, good. And that's it. I think that's all we are able to do in the first floor. Ooh, what's that symbol on the floor? We'll find out in due time. Or this is the old, the old, the old people apartment. And this is the wall of the basement that we we're just in. So you gotta go to the north stairwell. Oh wait, hold on. There's a boiler down here. Oh. Number three. Need four more to uncover the story. We'll find the rest of these boilers as we advance through the upper floors of this place. So right now we are on the second floor and cutscene. Oh my goodness, it's the girl. Hmm. Huh, can I do that? And it's like, huh? Hey, how the hell did it come back? Did I do that? Hey, hey, come back. Those notes? Aren't for you. Uh oh. Hmm. Looks like some sort of code or something. I don't know. I don't know what it is either. <laughs> I don't know. I'm up to the fourth floor before the police car away the evidence. Yep. There are other things to do on the fourth floor as well, including investigating, uh, you know, looking, not really investigating, but just looking through all these apartments here. There is a. A trio of friends playing poker, you can possess them to read their minds. No, they don't do much. Ooh! Wait, what the hell? Um, there's a. There's a thing on that TV. Wait, hold on, what is my possessed Alright. Pull up your panties, gentlemen, and throw in some chips, mate. Nope, can't do anything. Well, looks like I can't. Wait, hold on, we. Yeah, clicking the right stick was to go into first person mode, which lets you review things like that, but it's not of much use. Uh, at least I don't think so, not yet anyway. Uh, over here, you see these weird spectral things. They don't play much into what ha what's happening right now, because there is nothing happening right now, but they will come into a certain event that will happen later in, the, later in this part of the story. You also can pull Enjoy scaring kids. This little girl cost me everything. Nope. It was supposed to be a simple job. Easy money. What do you mean? She's just a kid. It don't matter what she is. Her daddy owed too much to the wrong people. She was just an insurance policy. Oh boy. Is that where you come in? A simple snatch and grab. After everything was settled up, I, I let her go. I'm guessing it wasn't so simple. Yeah, because he died. Maybe. But she owes me now. I ain't leave until her debt is paid. Oh, well, I got a better way to make you leave. Maybe. Don't worry. I can wait. I have a better way to make you leave. You know, it's called a. Uh, it's called encountering the en the enemies in this game. Called demons. Yes, these things. Are uh, they stalk you and they will try to suck out your suck up your soul? They'll chase you down, suck up your soul, and try to kill you. There is always a kill them, but it will be explained in this cutscene. <laughs> See, that's what they try to do to you. You can escape through the wall. And oh, oh God, a demon's coming! Hello. If demons find you, they will hunt you down and suck, you, suck out your soul like they did in the cutscene. However, the residue of ghost souls hides your presence from demons. Ta-da! Poof! You can move between hide objects to avoid demons. Like so. And so. And so. If demons can't find you for a while, they will stop checking and leave. Like that. Hold right down the right bumper to see demons through walls. Remember to always approach a demon carefully. Like so. And so you can exit from the hide object, and then you are s supposed to approach this demon careful. What the hell? Oh! Ghost girl messages. I forgot about those. Yeah, you can find various messages from the ghost girls scattered throughout the game. But uh, what we are gonna do is we're gonna sneak up on this demon, all sneaky like. 
see him over there, and then you must approach the demon from behind if you want to execute it. And we can kill him by entering a button combination like that, and he's dead. Ta-da! Oops. Dead demon. And that is how you deal with demons. That was only one of them. Uh, if I go up into the third, oops, anything. If I go up to the third floor, because there is actually literally nothing for us to do on the second floor. Other than that, if I go up to the third floor, ta-da! There's two of them. And what? Oh boy, I hate the noises they make. Nice thing to hide here. See that uh, in information thingy on the floor? I want it, but that demon is in the way. So what is gonna happen is. I'm gonna be patient and let this guy, let this idiot come back and then turn around and I'm gonna kill him. I can see him actually, his route is, he'll go to the end of that corner and then he'll go down that way. Here, he still won't see me. And he'll flip around. And then I'm gonna use my ghost sense, track him down, he'll go that way, and then execute! Oh goodness gracious. Okay, I, I screwed that one up, run! He's gone. <laughs> I uh, please don't check my spot. Please don't check my spot. Please check my spot. I think he, lo I think he lost me. Yeah, it's safe to say he lost me. Okay, so he's back there. Now. Okay, now you know what happens when you screw up. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna kill these two demons really quick, and then I'm gonna end the video because there is literally nothing to do on the second and third floors other than just uh, going around killing these two demons and collecting the other boiler fragments that are here. Okay, so I, now I know I need to hold down the trigger instead of just tapping the button. Tapping the trigger. Come on, turn around. And here, flip around. And can exit. Sneaky, 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 kill! Right, down! Yeah, he's dead. And then I can collect this. These are Lillian's thoughts. The Julia's thoughts, rather. Oh, 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 hold on guys, click! Yeah, you can, you, you can do Polter guys activity on some items. Uh, I want to kill that other demon. Also the- Ooh, there's a suicide here, but I'll get to you in a minute. Also, there's these two people that you can go through here. There's nothing much to do there. You can reveal- Ooh, what's this? Ooh, I actually didn't know that was there. Okay, so the demon's over there. Face through the wall and execute! Ah, oh, die! Oop, poof, dead. And that's it, that's all the demons there are in this apartment building. Which leaves me free to explore everything else. Oops. And there's another boiler fragment. I think there should be one more around here somewhere. Yeah, I think there is one more boiler fragment around here somewhere, because I know at the end of all this, I. At the end of all this, the last boiler is upstairs in the fourth floor apartment. Uh, let's not question him, because his story is kind of boring. Uh, how many more boilers did I need? Uh, three more. Okay. I think I might have missed. I might have missed the one or two on my way up here. Uh, oh, oh, lagging here, and ta-da, fourth floor! Hey, I need you to keep your distance from the scene here. What happened up here? I'm afraid that's still on. That's another boiler fragment. Oops, I will reveal like so. I think there are two more boilers in here. In there. Oh, crap! Cut You see that little girl that lives here? She turns up. You come find me. Got it? <laughs> Back, Baxter. Being as arrogant as ever, and this is the crime scene that Ronan was investigating shortly before he got thrown out a window and unceremoniously killed. And I managed to get there in three videos. <laughs> yeah, get here rather in three videos. Yay! Why is the subtitle still there? It's my go. Oh crap! I forgot. Damn I'm still a ghost. My mom gave me that gun. It's all. It's called Lillian. Let's see whether we can find the two other boilers. I 
and that is the investigation for the next video. If you liked the video, leave a like and a comment in the comment section below. Subscribe to my channel for more gaming videos and I will see you in the next video. Ta-ta!